I was going to run out just um, all dirty from cooking. I made some great chicken my mom and I did today with um, not very many ingredients, but oh man, it was good. And then I made a, um, her and I did, coconut cream pie, but with um, not actual sugar, you know. So I don't, I didn't add a lot of sugar. It's not really sweet. I could have added more, I guess. Probably didn't whip up the um, icing stuff or the Cool Whip stuff enough, but it's good. I like it. Anywho, this is for this. I got this today in the mail. And um, I wouldn't go through it first because I had the money in the bank, but then something was charged through this and um, something for YMCA tried to come out at the same time. And I don't know, something happened, but anyway, that it was all worked out. It says right down there, 40 years, man. How crazy, you know? <coughs> Looks like over there. See? In the back, you can see there. Which is cool, digital codes. The heat is on in 4K Ultra HD. For the first time in one collection, get the original action-packed comedies starring Eddie Murphy as street smart Detroit cop Axel Foley, tracking down his best friend's killer in Beverly Hills Cop. Actual, yeah, actual. Axel smashes through the local barriers in a hilarious high-speed pursuit of justice. In Beverly Hills Cop 2, he's deep undercover, investigating a gang of international munitions smugglers. The third installment, Beverly Hills Cop, Beverly, say that a lot, right? Beverly Hills Cop 3. Finds Axel at the center of a high stakes danger. Oh, yeah. Center of high stakes danger. Literally. As several clues lead him to a popular California amusement park. Oh, yeah, I remember that. <coughs> so, digital codes as well, which is cool. And, um, I guess we'll see what they look like. Why not? Use the digital codes anyway. Still, um, want to get an Apple Vision Pro. But I'm not going to get it right now. It's my mom as we put on one of her cards. Pay her. I told her earlier, I said, if you want, let me put in your car and get all the money out. I don't give a shit. Go to my I just don't want to get it. I mean, I don't care, but putting that much over, it takes such a long time. You know, you got to put the money over in the bank. It takes a while to figure it out. I don't know. There's the one. I can't say Beverly Hills. Shit. What the hell am I going to say next? Um, Spaddle Vision? <laughs> well, you pretty much know what these look like if you have the movies. <coughs> Back of that one. See that? It's kind of shiny in here. Sunny, shiny. One of my all time favorite movies, man. All these are. I guess three of my all time favorites. I'm, I'm excited to watch the new one. I, it's coming on um, was it Amazon Prime. It's starting to be notified when it becomes available. So, <clears throat> great movie, man. And, um, so, there's that. And it was um, 33 bucks, I think. Let me see the actual price I paid. Snake River Farms. I'll have to get meat from there one day. Let's see, um, uh-huh, 36 3 so it was a pretty good price, <coughs> and, um, yeah, all right, I got something from Van Eaton Galleries, they're having a, um, auction coming up soon, I like that place, but it'll say the price, like, two to three hundred bucks, and those things will go for tens of thousands of bucks, it's just, people pay so much, because they get into a frenzy, I guess, I mean, if I was like millions of had millions of bucks, certain things I would get. Like the, if they had the original Ghostbusters car used in the movie, I'd pay a ton of money for that. Because that's something I love that movie, you know. But some of that stuff, I just don't get why people would pay so much for it. But I guess I just answered my own question. Also, there are some VR games on sale. Um, Ghost Giant is nine ninety nine. Synth Riders is fourteen ninety nine. I want to get that one. Zombieland Headshot Fever is twelve ninety nine. I wanted to get that for a while. I might have it. The Room VR seventeen ninety nine. Lame Mill XR Dance, which you, my fatness dancing, but it could be good exercise. That is twenty one ninety nine. Pillow, I've wanted that for a while. Seven ninety nine. Warplanes Battle Over Pacific is thirteen ninety nine. The Last Clockwinder, which I think I've wanted for a while, is fourteen ninety nine. And Gun Club VR is twelve ninety nine. So. <clears throat> might get them if I like getting a gift card there though you know I don't like um because then I know exactly how much I have now I wouldn't spend a lot if I had a specific amount but stuff like that iTunes as well I just like um getting a gift card you know so you have a little a little window you can climb into you know what I mean so um am I talking fast <laughs> and um yeah you think anything else to chat about <clears throat> 
interesting, won't it be to see the new Xbox if they come out with a digital only one? How well will that sell? Don't they have a digital version now that, I mean, how well did that sell, you know? Why would anyone, I just don't get what the point is. So you would pay for that simply to be able to play games that you can already play on your, honestly, that's what I don't get. You can play Xbox um, Game Pass games on your PC or your Mac. So why would you pay for a box? I mean, graphics-wise, what could an Xbox device really do that a Mac or PC couldn't? You know, I, I don't understand it, but, oh well. <coughs> and, um, yeah. That's the Scott. There's also a Christmas movie with him on Amazon or Netflix. I haven't watched that yet either. I want to. Thank you guys for checking this video out. And, uh, if you like that movie or any of the movies, check them out. Pretty cool. And, uh, Fire alarm's going off. That's like my stepfather opened the bathroom door, my mom said. Steam's coming out. Is that a sexual reference? Sure the fuck hope not. <laughs>